Greetings! Today we'll be looking at two brake samples from Mach 3. We go over some of the manufacturer's torque limiters and clutches in other videos. Mach 3 makes air and spring applied clutches, mechanical torque limiters, clutch brake combination units, and brakes, including the two we have here. Take a look at our first sample, a D2F3R spring engaged brake. This is one of more than a dozen standard variations with many more customizable options. This modular brake design has subcomponents grouped into kits for drive hub elements, drive disc elements, piston elements, cylinder elements, and a final kit that includes two O-rings, 24 coil springs, and three friction discs. It's recommended that the end users keep the very common wear items on hand for critical applications where downtime must be minimized. Torque is to 91 pound inches and maximum speed is to 1750 RPM. As with most all brakes, the manufacturer recommends a service factor of 1.5 to 2 when calculating required torque. Brakes shouldn't be used at maximum rated torque for continuous duty. So that was a spring engaged brake. Now let's consider an air engaged brake, the Mach 3 B2F2R. Dynamic torque for this flange mounted brake at 80 psi input is 100 pound inches. Of course, torque capacity is only one factor when selecting a brake. Mach 3 recommends that design engineers contact the engineering department for application review and assistance. The pneumatic supply must include a flexible airline and correct fitting for the brake inlets and PT size and fixing with a thread sealing compound. Air supply should be both filtered and regulated. For more information, visit Mach3.com and MotionControlTips.com.